leave the golf course every day after work. When it's not too hot or not too cold, the entire golf course's grass areas are used every day by hundreds of non-golfers for walking, playing, sports, bikes, and golf when golfers aren't playing. It's about maintaining and enhancing our property values, yours and mine. We have three grown children who live in Seattle who need a place to come to play golf and play tennis in January, February, March, April. But people are using these golf courses in non-golf times right now for walking, biking. Every time a house is sold, we have to fill out a seller's property disclosure statement. The last page says other consideration and factors. What other materials, important information are you aware of concerning the property that might affect the buyer's decision making process on um, the value of the valuation of the property? And I, along with my family, neighbors, and golf friends, oppose this option mainly because it will take away our training facility, reduce property value, and there's no clear proposal proposal as to what will become of our backyard. And there's an older couple who can no longer exercise, but who sit outside on their patio every morning, enjoying the opportunity to watch and wave to golfers who pass by. There's a gentleman who suffers from Age of Orange, who enjoys not only watching the golfers pass by, but greeting them with a friendly hello, and perhaps a 30-second conversation. There are a number of teenage golfers who practice and golf regularly. There is a gentleman who, due to medical issues, no longer golfs, but stands at the fence in his backyard, watching the golfers pass by as he thinks about what could have been. He would sorely miss not watching the golfers. I have seen children, after the golfers have finished playing, practice slumber on the fairway. Every early morning and late in the day, I see dog walkers walking, not on the cart path, but down the green fairway, allowing even our four-legged friends to enjoy the golf course. All of our friends are golfers, not because we like only golfers, but because golf provided the vehicle to meet people. We now have fabulous doctors, dentists, hairdressers, and more due to recommendations from those people. It's wonderful when your friends and uh, people out of town come to visit you and say, Boy, don't you live in a, in a beautiful place? You have green golf courses here. It's like you live in a, a resort. I use it for uh, walking and just as a as a uh, recreation to be able to look at the, the beautiful scenery around here. We enjoy watching the golfers. We enjoy the lifestyle that it affords. But I don't want my dream and every one of our residents' investments to become a cautionary tale. The golf courses uh, are an amenity for all of Oro Valley. Every resident in Oro Valley benefits from the amenities that are here. Home values have increased since I got here. Um, I'd like to think that I would have that increase to pass on to my uh, family when I pass. We have made many new friends, and it's only possible because of our computer. I want you to imagine our beautiful hometown. My five-year-old once described it as that she lives in a town that has a crown of mountains and emerald jewels that shine in the valley. Those emerald jewels are our golf courses.